All right, Coach. Uh, tough one tonight. Top ball game, six and a half to play. 10-0 uh, run by St. Mary's. Just kind of put the distance between you. Uh, talk about uh, what you did to get to the tie game and what happened after. Well, yeah, yeah, we really didn't play that well. I mean, other than offensively Dawn showing up, um, you're looking at Steph and um, Erica really struggled. Um, and I think uh, this was just a, a classic case of our, our kids just wanting it too bad, you know, and not really knowing what it's like to play in this game um, with the stakes so high, with both teams being undefeated in conference. Um, you know, it was a back and forth game, and um, we I, th I believe at that point we had started pressing um, and got some turnovers off of their press and got some easy buckets in transition without them being able to set up uh, their half court uh, defense. So, um, and then the 10 0 run, you know, they just scored points. And, um, and we got panicked and rattled, um, and we weren't able to answer. Uh, talk about, you said Dawn uh, obviously got her scoring in. She had 22 tonight. But I mean, after that, uh, Decker's with 10 and just kind of fell off after that. Just, you, couldn't have, you didn't have that second go to person tonight. No, we didn't. Um, and, and anytime you look up and Steph shot, shot 17 times, that, that's not good for us. Um, it, it's just, it, it means that too many shots are being taken on the outside and not enough looks inside. We didn't capitalize on the mismatches inside as much as we should have. I mean, they have five, nine girl guarding our second post the majority of the game. Um, and, and again, I think the kids were too amped up, too anxious. Um, and and just didn't handle the emotions of this game very well. Well, last week you got you got rid of the uh, conference yet non-conference games. This week they count in conference. You got to put it past you, put it behind you, and they got AM International on Saturday. Talk about that game. Yeah, I mean that that was the the tone of the um, post game talk in the locker room with the girls. I mean. Um, and it's something that we talk about quite a bit. We didn't we didn't do it well in this game. We talk about letting the past be the past and moving on, um, staying in the present, and not worrying about the future. Um, and and that's going to be the telltale: is can can we let this game go and step up to the plate for another big game Saturday? Because Saturday's game is just as big, if not bigger, than tonight's game. It's one of those games you really need to get on the road. Um, and, and I think the kids will respond. I mean, I saw a very upbeat locker room, but also a very disappointed, very um, dejected locker room with self-performance. Um, and, and I think they will respond. They've shown that they can respond. Every time we've needed to respond this year, they have. And I don't think that it'll be any different for Saturday.